the year is 1952. The place? RAF Topcliffe, which is a Royal Air Force station in North Yorkshire, England. A silver disc-shaped UFO followed a British meteor jet for a few seconds, then took off at an unnatural speed and disappeared. On September 19, 1952, at about 10.53 hours, during an RAF exercise, two RAF officers and three aircrew witnessed the event. The report was made by Flight Lieutenant John Kilburn, who stated, The meteor was crossing from east to west when I noticed the white object in the sky. This object was silver and circular in shape, about 10.000 feet some 5 miles astern from the aircraft. It appeared to be traveling at a lower speed than the meteor but was on the same course. I said, what the hell is that? And the chaps looked to where I was pointing. But as we watched the disc maintained a slow forward speed for a few seconds before starting to descend. While descending it was swinging in a pendulum fashion from left to right. As the meteor turned to start its landing run the object appeared to be following it. But after a few seconds it stopped its descent and hung in the air rotating as if on its own axis. Then is accelerated an incredible speed to the west. Turned southeast and disappeared. It is difficult to estimate the object's speed. The incident happened in a matter of 15 to 20 seconds. During the few seconds that it rotated we could see it flashing in the sunshine. It appeared to be about the size of a vampire jet aircraft at a similar height. We are all convinced that it was some type of solid object. Intelligence officers at RAF Topcliffe interrogated the officers and crew. The Air Ministry eventually admitted that they were unable to explain the sighting after 11 weeks of inquiry. The incident is really hard to explain away. Qualified military officer observers witnessed something very unusual during great weather and visibility conditions. The craft's maneuvers and acceleration were way beyond any known terrestrial airplanes in 1952. 